Okay, so talk to me about these travelers and what their motives are coming up for the rest of the season. Yeah, well, what we try to do with the travelers this year, just so things didn't get too confusing mythology-wise, is kind of like have them in the background okay. since the beginning of the season. And now, as their leader, Marcos, is kind of like going to be showing up, we start to understand, oh, here's what they want. And it turns out what they want will shed light onto why the doppelgangers are so important into the ser series. We're not going to ignore the fact that it's weird that like there are all these doppelgangers out there. Okay. And we're going to understand what that doppelganger prophecy is that meant stuff in and Elena are meant to be together, and we're going to finally get what that is. Okay, and so talk to me about Luke and Liv, the brother-sister duo who seem to be pretty sneaky. Yeah, I mean, you know no character on the show just pops up for, for <laughs> just because they're bored. They're like, so, um, yeah, Liv and Luke have were sent by their witch coven with a very specific agenda. And But the thing about them is that they also have, they're like kids, that they have hearts, and they actually like, they, you know, they like these people, so they're not these evil bad guys. But they have a very specific thing that they need to do, and they're going to do it, and... If people get hurt along the way, that's all there is to it. Do you think Damon and Elena will be able to stay away from each other? I mean, <laughs> if you try being in a room with Ian Summerhall, they're like, you know, it's not going to be easy just to not pay attention to him. So, of course, Elena's going to suffer. And it's, it's going to be an interesting storyline, the way that plays out. And what can you tell me about Caroline's love life? Because right now it's very up in the air. Is it Tyler? Is it Enzo? Is it Stefan? Yeah, the problem with Caroline is you throw her in a room with anyone, and it's like, yes, I want them together. So she has too much chemistry. So you got to whittle it down, you know? And so she ends up, you know... Uh, she ends up being in a storyline with Enzo in this next episode, and it's like, okay, they have some really good charms between the two of them. But um, she's, you know, she's still wounded from the whole Klaus-Tyler thing. Okay. Um, and what about for Matt? Poor Matt. He's always kind of just stuck in the middle of everything. Oh, that poor guy. Well, he and Jeremy and Tyler end up kind of bonding together and they have their own mission which it becomes about mystic falls and so they're gonna be like working as we in the writers room we call them the strike force because it's like the, the the three dudes you know working to protect the town and so they end up kind of bonding over that and having their own set of problems okay.